I'm here with you today. I I'm sorry, I look so scruffy. I've been working with my dad. As you can see, he works on um, semis. But I, I just wanted y'all to have an insight on what happens in my daily life whenever I go to my dad's. Okay, so sometimes, but I usually go work with my stepdad or something like that. My no, not my stepdad. My stepmom's stepdad, because at his mom's house, we usually go out there and help him do stuff. Or maybe we'll go in one of the service trucks and go out and help people with their problems with their semi. But I just also, I'm going to put a video up later, but we had a storm last night. And it was really bad. It pushed over in an RV, flipped it on its side. Everything inside ruined, glass broke, everything. But it, I mean, you can't, you can't stop that. Like that's the storm last night was just so bad, and I just don't know what they could have done. Hold on. Now I'm on the other side of the trailer. But I mean. Put in the comments what you would have done. But, uh, usually I help my dad, but he's in that trailer over there. And it's pretty dark in there. <laughs> but, or I can go up these stairs and help my stepmom clean. Give you a little insight on what they're doing. See, it's dark in there. They're trying to fix the motor that runs these things. They're like stuff you load it with, I don't know, or unload. And it's beautiful outside today, but I've just been inside playing on my phone, working with my dad. I need a shower. Like, I'm dirty all the way up my hair and down my arms. Oh gosh, the brightness! Woo! But the trailer was over there, and it got knocked over. And like I said, we had nothing to do with it. It was all the storm, and it was horrid because that guy—that was his home. Because he drives these trailers out here, and. That's his home, because his home is like two hours away, so whenever he brings the truck and trailer over here, that's where he stays. So they had to pick up that trailer, bring it all the way back to their home, and they did it earlier. They gave me a hug because I offered my assistance if they needed me to help them clean it out. And also, go check out my... Oh crap. Nope, I'm not going to talk about that right now. But... It was just horrid. But I'm gonna probably get off here in a couple minutes. Why is this air on?
thing. So I was doing the floors and I made this really cool design. But look. Right right there. Hold on. But it looks really, really nice. I don't know if you can see it. Y'all heard a word I said earlier? You know what? Don't fall. But I'm gonna show y'all the tires or of the work. If I can open it. And if this oh crap. Where's a light switch? Is there even a light switch in here? That's a tire place. Oh. oh, there we go. But here's where we store all the trailer tires. And this is what none of the students at my school think. They think I'm a weak, good-for-nothing person. But I changed these tires with my dad. I could do it by myself. I also laid posts to a freaking fence in the ground. Kept picking them up, like, probably... 50 or 60 of them. And I'm not weak. And I'm not strong. Boy, go get a life. You spoiled brat. But, I might. Before I leave and let y'all go, I just want to say check out my boy's channel. Boy's channel. His name is Anna Boy, Anime Boy. Five six five four three for the three it's a space so anime boy six five four space three but that's I give you an insight on what I do so catch you later see ya also I'm making an intro I'm going to make an intro just for you guys okay I'm gonna and if y'all have any hints on how to make an intro, I, I'm gonna need them. Because I have no idea. But I'll talk to y'all later. See ya, deuces.